welcome to Kids Academy. Hello everyone. Let's open the worksheet. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. You can find the link to this app in the comments below. Hello boys and girls, it's Teacher Michael with Kids Academy. And today, I'd like to talk to you about 3D shapes and faces. No, not those kinds of faces. The kinds of faces that you'll find in shapes. Well, what kind of faces will you find in shapes? A face is just the flat part of any shape. So for example, if we took a look at our cube, this cube has many faces. It's all the flat surfaces that you see in the front, on the side, on top, on the bottom. It's any flat surface of the shape. So let's read the directions for our worksheet and get started right away. Faces of 3D shapes. In each row, check the solid shape that has the face shown on the left. Okay, so we're gonna be looking at some faces and trying to find out which shapes they belong to. So let's take a look at our first face. We have a square face. So which one of these shapes does a square face belong to? So if we took a look at our first shape, I see a cube. Already I'm starting to think this cube is the right shape because this cube has many square faces. So I think that this square face belongs to this shape. But let's check out the other shapes just to be sure. This sphere, believe it or not, has no shapes. This sphere, believe it or not, has no faces. So this can't be correct either. And finally, our cone has no square faces. It has a circular face on the bottom, but it doesn't have a square face. So the correct answer is our cube, because the cube has a square face. Let's check out our next face. Our next face is rectangular. So which shape does this rectangular face belong to? Our first shape is a sphere. And do you remember what I said about spheres? Spheres have no faces, so this can't be correct. Our next shape is a cone. A cone has that circular face on the bottom, but it doesn't have any rectangular faces, so this can't be correct. And our last shape is known as a rectangular prism. Do you see any rectangular faces on this shape? I do, so I think this rectangular prism has rectangular faces. They even have similarities in their name. So let's go ahead and check this shape because I see this rectangular face in this rectangular prism. Our next face is triangular. So our triangular face has to match up with a shape that has this triangular face. So let's check out our shapes. Our first shape is a cone. Now the cone shares some similarities with the triangle in the way that it looks, but it does not have a triangular face, so this cannot be correct. Our second shape is a cube. This also does not have a triangular face, so this can't be correct either. Finally, we have our pyramid. And I can see quite a few triangular faces on our pyramid. So I know that our pyramid is the correct answer. Let's go ahead and check our pyramid because it does have a triangular face. Finally, our last face is circular. So this is tricky because the first shape shown is a sphere. And our brains probably think, yeah, this sphere looks like a circle, so it must have a circular face. But no. Remember, spheres have no faces, so this can't be correct. Our next shape is a cylinder. And if you look from the top down, you'll see a circular face on top of the cylinder and on the bottom or beneath the cylinder. So this shape does have a circular face. And I know that's correct because our last shape of a cube does not have a circular face. Remember, boys and girls, when you're trying to identify faces, in shapes, remember you're just looking for a flat surface. Thanks for watching, boys and girls, and we'll see you next time. Subscribe to our channel to stay updated on new videos. Find links to our apps in the comments below.